What's up everybody? It's Green 154 coming at you live once again from my lovely bedroom. How'd you like that little voice? Uh, anyway, uh, it's that time of month again. Loop crate. It's actually a decent sized crate this month. Really big. Um, still waiting for my nerd block. They should be here. They said the 24th or 25th is when they ship out. So most likely they'll be here Friday, Saturday, or Monday. Whenever they get here, I'll let everybody know when I do videos. Because I actually signed up for the horror block this month. I dropped the classic, signed up for the horror block, and of course I kept the arcade block because I'm a nerd and a gamer. Alright, so this month's theme was... Oh, what was it? Oh, that's in the book. I'll tell you in a minute. Um, it's actually pretty cool. The box is... It's like a, it's like a, a board game. And it says, Crate Packing Simulator 2015. Pretty neat, pretty cool. Uh, first, I was kind of let down because there wasn't a t-shirt this month. There wasn't one last month. Actually, yeah, there was. There, it was this shirt that I'm wearing right here. I don't know where my head's at, but anyways. I got a Loot Crate exclusive Money World. Uh, it says, Design, Admire, and Inspire. Create your own vinyl art toy. Close three wipe off markers. Mini money. It's spelled like mummy, but it's money. Um, you know, it's pretty cool. It's like one of those pop vinyls that you get. I normally don't open them because I collect them, but this one, since it's one that's you can draw on it and stuff, I will open it and bring it out of the package. I'll probably let my girlfriend have it or let her play with it when she's here. And it's just like a, it's like a little pop vinyl. Move, posable head, posable arms. Comes with these uh, wipe off markers. Pretty neat, pretty cool. Uh, like I said, I'll probably let my girlfriend play with it. Uh, I'm not really into. I'm not very artistic. She's she's really artistic. She's pretty good. Actually, she's really good. But not my style. Next, we have a hex bug ant. And I actually, I got one of these, I'll, I'll bring it out of the package in a second to show you better, but I got one of these in a crate that was like Transformers themed or something, and it was a hex bug, and it was like a miniature cockroach that vibrates, moves across the floor with its little rubber legs, it's pretty, pretty cool. Uh, but this is a hex bug ant, and I guess hex bug is a thing now, I don't know. It's been a reoccurring theme in Loot Crate, you know, like I said, more from one of the, it was like the second or third crate I got, uh, and it had the little hex bug roach. I don't know if it was a roach, but it looked like a roach. This one's just a, I'm not going to sit here and take 10 minutes to open this thing to show everybody. I might show it in another video, but this is a uh, ant, hex bug ant. Pretty neat, pretty cool. Uh, I guess he scoots across the floor with his little turbine legs. It comes with push. Uh, push button or whatever, push batteries, whatever it's called, pin, whatever. And I actually got, I think it's dice, I'm not for certain. It is dice, and it's a white and black one, and it looks like rock, paper, scissors. Kind of hard to see that design, well no, not really. See, the designs on it, rock, paper, scissors, pretty cool, pretty neat little dice uh, from what I heard spoilers uh, I don't know I kinda I know you can just unsubscribe from them but like the little loot crate and nerd block uh, emails that you sign up for or you can sign up for it, it, it spoils what you're gonna get every month like I noticed that I was getting messages from nerd block saying this is gonna be in it and this is gonna be on it, in it and I'm like what's the point in having a blindfold type box where you don't know what's inside some people like it, I guess. I don't know. Um, Super Fight the Loot Crate Deck. Skybound Games. I don't know what Super Fight is. It says this is a 100 card version of the viral card game Super Fight. Designed exclusively for Loot Crate by Skybound. These cards are only available in this exclusive deck. Create hilarious fighters with these cards and argue over who would win in a fight between them. Uh, like... 
Is it like cosplay with cards or something? I don't know. I'm gonna open this up and figure it out. It's gonna be a super long video. Super Fight Loot Crate Deck. Super Fight. Rule. Separate the white backed cards, characters, and the black backed cards attributes. Player one starts by drawing three white cards and three black cards. You can look at them, but don't let anyone else see them. And it has. Oh. It's kind of weird. It's. it's it's got these white cards, okay, super fight on the back, and you're supposed to split them up into, into four different groups because they do have blue, and they also have purple, and just by looking at them, they look pretty cool. One says Derby Girl, Godzilla, Ocelot, Susie Chef, and then the black cards are the attributes, I think is what it said. Yeah, the black back cards are attributes. It says can only be killed by a stake through the heart. Wrapped in toilet paper. It commands an army of disposable minions. Literally a gif. Armed with a machete. Then you've got the blue. Which I honestly don't know what the blue are. But it says Godzilla stomach. Old rope bridge over lava. On a roller coaster. I guess those are like scenarios or scenes where you would be at deep in the Amazon rainforest. So locations. And then the purple says... All fighters armed with chainsaws. All fighters armed with gasoline squirt guns. Fighter cannot see or hear. So I guess it's like things that are working against you, like elements or something. It's pretty cool. I might try this out. Some of my friends. Maybe. If I had friends. No, but seriously, I'm going to try this because it, it looks pretty cool. Now that I'm looking at the cards. I thought it was kind of lame when I first opened it, but it's actually really cool looking. But anyways, that's Super Fight Loot Crate Deck. Pretty neat. And then there's a book, New York Times bestseller, Ready Player One. It's actually a novel, very thick. Looks to have almost 400 pages. In the year 2044, reality is an ugly place. The only time teenage Wade Watts really feels alive is when he's jacked into the virtual utopia known as the Oasis. So it's like it's a live action sort of role playing game or virtual reality. It seems it's pretty cool. I'm definitely going to read that. I'm into that kind of stuff. Um, and of course, oh, uh, this this the theme this month is play. These books are always pretty neat. Always, so I'll take them to work with me, and I'll keep them. I keep it in my little like I call it my briefcase, but it's like a little binder. Just look through it, and here's like the little the mega crate stuff. This is stuff that you're entered to win every time you subscribe to Loot Crate. Like every month that you sign up for or you stay signed up. You're entered to win. It actually has some really good prizes. It's got like a Dremel Idea Builder 3D printer. Those have actually become really popular. $999.99, you could have won it for free. Or for the $13 it costs to get Loot Crate. The Oculus Rift Development Kit. Uh, still in development. I wouldn't want one. Now. I mean, for free, I would take a I would take an Oculus Rift, but I want them when they're at, at their best. Then it, they gave away some Lego Minecraft crafting box, uh, the mine, the Ender Dragon, Indoor Dragon. And then it just explains kind of what you got in it that month. I gotta hurry up because this video is like really long and I'm not I'm not good at editing at all. But uh, Firefly Online, pretty cool. You get a Callahan full bore auto lock assault rifle. Pretty neat. Never got into Firefly. And then on the booklet, it actually comes with these little stamp out or pop out stamps like that are piece, game pieces. And it says Crate Packing Simulator 2015. Uh, and it's kind of, I don't know, it's kind of weird. I don't know. And then last but not least, a poster, I believe. Pull it out and take a look. And it is a poster, and it's, oh, it's really cool. It's like where they took the original game for Pac-Man and, like, broke it down, and it has its own little, like, the little Pac-Man world in it, and it shows what it's made of. It's really cool. And then the little tin, little uh, February 2015 play, really cool little pin. 
get a pin each month. Usually get a t-shirt. We didn't get one this month, but we got one last month. It's really cool Voltron shirt. So anyways, that was February's Loot Crate play. Um, if you want to sign up, I'll have a link in the description box. Uh, it'll, if you sign up using my name, you'll save some money, and I'll make a little bit of money towards my next crate. Um, if not, you can always come back here and watch me do it each month. I, I enjoy making these little videos each month. It's nice to know that there's a few people out there that enjoy some of the same things I do. But as always, it's Grimmel54 coming at you live from my bedroom. Uh, expect a video either Friday or next week once I get my nerd block or my arcade block and my horror block and I'll open those for you guys um, so as always take it easy thank you for watching